right now it's 5 30 um it's saturday and i have to go to the agenda festival um and i didn't really get many much sleep last night at all i ended up just pulling an all-nighter and watching youtube pretty much the whole night but um yeah i'm actually not that tired for not for pulling an all-nighter but i thought i'd go out to the beach and you know just grab a coffee really quick and I don't know if you can see me that well because it's still pretty dark right now but yeah I just wanted to grab a coffee and just watch the sunrise it's a beautiful day out here and I will catch you guys at the beach All right, can I get a large caramel iced coffee with no ice? No, thank you. Okay, thank you. It's the next morning after the agenda show or the agenda festival, but I didn't really get any footage at all because I just wanted to kind of enjoy the show, look around. Um, I didn't really want to worry too much about filming because I was kind of there a little late because um, parking was really hard to find. But I'm going to be going to 86 Fest. I just bought tickets just now, like 10 minutes ago. So I got to go print them out and then I'll be going to 86 Fest and um, TJ Hunt is there, so <laughs> hopefully I can see him. I saw Ben Baller yesterday, which is really cool. Um, he's a really cool guy, and um, yeah, so let's get this day started. All right, guys, so I just got here to 86 Fest. It's hot though, but let's see if I can get in.
neutral. Okay. Easy. Two. Be consistent. Three. Do claps. If you wanna if you wanna spread yourself out, try to work with other creators to expose their audience and also your audience. Easy. Yeah. And you can even take a picture with your model if you want to. No, no. And then Kevin and Daddy are like, hey, you! Come on, it's free, guys! Come on! Wait a minute, we're on free, look! Don't cheat shit! Dude, I appreciate it so much. Right under your boy! What marker are you using? The black one? Yeah. I appreciate it. Every hour, all the hour. here so far here are 86 fest now i'm not really into 86 like the frs's and the brz's but i'm more into euro cars even though even though i own a civic but it's been so cool um especially meeting like tj hunt and dustin and danny and evan and calvin you know i've been watching these guys for a while now and they're kind of what keep my fire lit i guess for my car passion they keep that going for me even though i mean i love cars on my own but like seeing them and their passion for cars it's truly amazing but <laughs> i was going to sit down to eat my acai bowl if you guys don't know what that is um acai is kind of like a berry and they just blend it and like and make it frozen and then they put like granola and usually like some kind of fruit on top and it's really good and it's the first acai bowl I had since coming back to California because they don't really have them out in the Midwest that I know of. And look what happens here, guys. I dropped the f***ing acai bowl. I'm so bummed right now, but good thing it was only like five bucks. Maybe I'll just go get another one, but... Like I said, it's been an amazing experience here so far, and I'm so blessed to be able to meet people because even though this is 86 fest as you can see behind me there's a Chevelle so there's all kinds of car trucks I've seen two type R's I've seen of course a lot of BRZ's and FRS's but yeah there's all kinds of cool cars out here I saw the Porsche GT3 so they have Euro, American, Japanese, all of it so yeah like I said there's a GTR I'm not gonna even lie I came here mainly to see TJ Hunt because I saw that he's gonna come here. Um, but I'm so glad I did. It's it's cool to see stuff like this. I've never been to an event like this with racing and stuff like that. I didn't get too many clips of racing just because this this is a GoPro and I have no zoom and it's really hard to because they're so far away and you have to be so far back in the audience uh, just because of safety rules. But I was able to talk to TJ Hunt, really cool guy. All of the gang, um, you know, Dustin, Danny, uh, TJ Hunt all of them um, Calvin Evan all really cool guys and they're just as cool in person as they are in video um, which is good to see because I feel like a lot of, a lot of youtubers may or like not even youtubers but like just famous people in general like celebrities and stuff they all seem to maybe you know act completely different but you know it's good to see how transparent they are in person which is something if like as my channel grows and grows I want to be the same in person as I am on, you know, on film, so on video. So I hope I can maintain that, and I feel like it's a lot harder than it looks. So I give them big props for all those guys for being so transparent and you know just being so chill in person as they are on camera, and just taking the time to um, just taking the time to talk to like me and. You know, spending time and like they're not just like, oh yeah, I'll sign this for you and I gotta go. They, you know, they take their time to meet you and try to talk to you, which is really cool. I really appreciate that. Um, I know it's hard because so many people want to, you know, see you, talk to you, and stuff like that. And I realize, you know, they're super busy and stuff, but they, I mean, they all took their time to, you know, talk to me. So it was really cool. And I got a couple tips for them, which I will put in now. So yeah, um, 
Yeah. I'm really glad I went to this event, but it's time to head back. It's it's 95 degrees right now, and I can't handle it, bro. It's just too much. So I'm looking forward to getting back. And uh, if TJ, if you are watching this, which you probably are, or any of the guys, Dustin, 